Welcome back everyone, Kicking Back here, and I, uh, so I have 20 Zetas, and you can see uh, this, the, you know, the one is on each one of these to show that it can be upgraded because I have those 20 Zetas and just enough Omegas apparently, and I am thinking, planning on omega in. Or, uh, I'm sorry, zeta in it binds all things. The added benefit is that if you see here, Luke has plus 40 poten uh, percent potency. Whenever he resists a detrimental effect, he recovers 5% health. Well, with the zeta, he also recovers 5% protection. And then, which, mm, yeah, that doesn't matter a ton. But then whenever he inflicts a debuff, he gains 10% turn meter, and other allies gain half that amount. So, basically this allows everyone to keep you know, getting faster, um, going quicker, and that's kind of my plan. And so I'm going to go ahead and do this. Always a scary, kind of scary moment when you say to someone, you're like, uh, I want to try them out. I want to see how they fit in. We're going to test them out, see how this works. I, yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Um, oh, uh, let's, hmm. Who do I put him in for? I almost want to put him in, well, should I put him in for Rex? what to do what to do I think I have seen him being run without GK so we're gonna try this I don't know how it's gonna work but we're gonna go for it he's still low geared he's geared 9 almost at gear 10 but we will see so first, I'm gonna just handle Kylo there. Get uh, Chirrut back from being stunned. Let's stealth everyone. And let's go after Raid Han because he will do a ton of damage if we are not careful. And I wanna just go ahead and get him out of the, out of the picture. Gotta love the all the different counters. Go after Palpatine just since he's already kind of weak. And Palpatine's down, so let's hit Kylo. Let's go ahead and give Luke call to action and just keep wailing on Kylo for the moment. Clear days off of him. I like that Kylo has not gone so far. And now I'm going to put... Oh, I was trying to put buff immunity on Maul, but didn't work. It's okay, we'll finish off Palpatine there. Keep pounding away on Kylo. No stun, which is a bummer. <laughs> There's the stun. I forgot that... I always forget that he stuns on his basic if they have speed down. I'm going to keep, let's stun, I was gonna try to stun uh, Sidious there, but it doesn't seem to have worked. Let's take away that offense up. Finish off Kylo. There we go. Stun Sidious, nope, didn't get it. Go after Maul. And Sidious. Ah, the dodge. Knew that was coming at some point. Kill Maul. Take away all of that. And it looks like we're pretty much done here. Luke for the win. Uh, not for the win, but... Alright, that was not shabby. 
Uh, it will be interesting to see. Um, it's a couple hours before my payout, so it will be interesting to see if I am a target with a lower level, you know, Gear 9 CLS, but we'll have to see. Um, I'm sure typically it's it's a test to to see kind of what the right team comp is um, but when you see like he's running he's being run in so many different ways on the shard wow that guy is actually not running him at all um, with with Rex also not running him wow this is this is impressive you see a lot of running him as leader there's one running him with Barris and any other I'm sure once we get down a little bit how everyone's running him as leader this guy is running him um, with Chase and Nihilus so I don't know we'll see we'll see how it goes thanks for tuning in as always catch you next time